Hello and welcome to this week's episode of The Contested Narrative. We're looking at Remember Me by Linda Renham. Now, this book came through to me uh, from the author um, due to me helping her out with something and my goodness. So basically, you've got this young mother um, who makes friends with her neighbour who moves in and it's this psychological thriller because the neighbour, uh, Shani, seems to be like, so So her husband is fine, but Shani seems to start taking an interest in the little boy and Claire is kind of feels like she's losing control and, and she's going crazy and everything's not as it seems. And she feels like she's the only one that sees it because her husband's going, don't be stupid. Like everything's exactly as it seems. I don't know what you're going on about. Um, and everybody else is going, no, we love Shani. Shani's amazing. Like she's absolutely lovely. And it just follows this kind of descent into madness with Claire trying to figure out if there is something else going on with this woman that's looking after her child. And it's just little things like, you know, the blanket will go missing or the vase hasn't been returned. And she's like, no, this hasn't happened. And then suddenly the vase turns up and it's, like, it's been here for weeks, don't you remember? I handed it over. And it's just things like that. And oh my God, the ending. Now, you know, I never discuss endings and I will not start now because I know full well that I, I love people to experience the ending of books by themselves organically. And I hate giving away spoilers unless it's my book's film adaptation. But even then I wait until I've, I've given my review of the book and the film. And then I say spoilers and I let people go away. I will not give away the ending to this, but I am just saying that it was so satisfying and it felt and you felt vindicated by the end of it because it's great it, the, the writing was really good and the 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 characters were great and i'm definitely looking to get more uh, of uh, linda's books because they are i mean this one i read it's a four out of five it is a very very good book and you kind of you you are sat there and going through this with the mom going is she crazy is she not crazy? Like pills, she'd be like, oh, I, you know, I've got this many pills left. And then suddenly she's like, I don't remember taking as many as I have. And yet I don't have that many pills left. And I'm like, huh. And then you're kind of trying to formulate, as a reader, you're trying to formulate your own kind of plot going, is this just Claire's kind of madness? Like, is she losing a grip on reality? Should she get help? Should she be sectioned by her husband? Uh, <laughs> but it is a case of like, you just, as you're taking this journey with the characters, every little bit, you just kind of like, oh, oh, that's good. Oh, that's good as well. And honestly, I would recommend this book. I would say, you know, get it on Kindle, borrow it from a library, paperback, hardback, whatever it is that you'd like. But it's, it's also that idea, because the tagline is, would you trust a child with someone you hardly know? And would you? Like, if a neighbour moved in, and then a week later you realised that you had no childcare, but you had to go into work, but your neighbour saying, I can look after your kid for you, would you trust that, that person with your child? Like, how far do you go with trusting your child with somebody else? And is the child, that, is the person that you're trusting your child with trustworthy, essentially? And... It is a very, very, very good, like it gets gets into your head and it gets you thinking about what the ins and outs are and what, who saw what basically. So I would definitely 100% say give this book a read. Leave it below in the comments if you agree or disagree with anything I say. Let me know as well like what you think of these books, especially with the psychological ones, especially with the kind of like what's going on. Did you figure out what was happening before the reveal? Do you... Did you did you agree with with the with the certain characters? I'm I'm always interested to know what people think. But don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you're alerted whenever new videos come out. And thank you so much for your continued support. And remember to always keep it consenso.